Hello students. In this video, we'll look at the fourth geometry fact, which is angles around a point add to 360 degrees. So if you have two straight angles, um, what you end up with basically is uh, 360 degrees, and that basically covers every single angle around, around a single point. So there's the coded reason for it. So angles around a point, there's the point there, add to 360. Okay, let's have a look. I'll do a couple of these, then I'll have, let you have a go at doing a couple as well. So I might do these two and let you have a go at the two on the right. So I'll do this one using my algebraic method. So I know that all of these angles add to 360. So H plus 140 plus 80 equals 360. Now I have to add the numbers together. So 14 plus 8 is 22, so that's 220 equals 360. Subtract 220 from each side. And H equals 140 degrees. And the coded reason for that is angles around a point add to 360. Okay, I'm going to scroll down to do this next one. Okay, so what I'm going to do here, I'll do this algebraically again. Once we start to get the Y appearing or the unknown appearing more than once, it's probably easiest to do it using algebra. So all of these angles, whoops, all of these angles add to 360 degrees. Why is that not disappearing? Anyhow. Let's go ahead and just continue. So I can say y plus y is 2y plus, how about 160 plus 90? Do that in my head, is 250. And that must add to 360 degrees. Okay, subtract the 250 from each side. Whatever we do to one side, we do to the other side. That gives me 2y equals 110 degrees. And finally, divide both sides by 2, and y is 55 degrees. And the coded reason for it, or the reason for it, is angles around a point add to 360. Okay, you go ahead, please, and try the next two questions on your own. Okay, let's see how you went on that. So here we have three angles, x plus 30 plus 90 adds to 360. I'll do this one using this method, the one-step method. x must equal 360. Take, well, 60 plus 30 is 90, so I can add those in my head. And therefore, x must be 270 degrees. And the reason for it is angles around a point add to 360. This last question, probably again best done using algebra, because once the variable appears more than once, that seems to be the logical way to do it. y plus y plus y plus y plus y, we can write that as 5 times y equals 360 degrees. And to solve that equation, we just divide by 5, and y is 72 degrees and we always have to give a coded reason. In this case, angles around a point add to 360 degrees. And that's it.